hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel kindly subscribe like comment and share if you are new here please ring that notifications bell so that you get notified anytime i upload a new video welcome to our number one entertainment channel your number one motion rudaku channel and i'm here to keep you updated on what is trending now to governor alfred mutua and lilian nganga's story nganga lilian has come out to say what she has been going through since they parted ways a few months ago with the machakos governor so nganga lilian says today in the company of my lawyer philip murkor i held a press statement in regard to threats fraud and theft by governor alfred mutua in brief number one alfred broke into my apartment parking with his bodyguard and drove away a car i have fully owed since 2014 he fraudulently transferred the logbook into his name and proceeded to sell it to a third party number two he fraudulently transferred my shares in the hotel company to his sister Anne Mutua and made her director. Anne Mutua now runs the A and L hotel as director. I spent years building the hotel and have since been fully managing it as the director up till August 2021. Number three, he threatened to kill people close to me and promised to crush me to ash and in the process activate his social media to completely finish me and my friends. This is after I declined his order for me to apologize and retract the statement I made about our separation. Number four, he promised to collect everything I have and own. This has indeed started as he has asked I refund any money he has spent on me and all monies he has ever availed for my use. Number five, all forms of gender-based violence including psychological and economical violence must be called out and the perpetrators punished heavily number six alfred must stop disrespecting and degrading women so that is a statement from a former machakos county first lady lillian nganga who is also uh, the ex-wife to governor alfred motua she is saying that dr alfred motua is threatening her and now her life is in danger you guys what do you think leave your comment down below see you on the next one bye